Hello, uh, been a while, as I say at the beginning of every video, uh, but I'm just going to upload whenever the hell I want. Um, so I'm going to start a new little series uh, called Before and After, which I thought might get me into a more regular schedule of uploading. Which basically what I do, it's going to be very short each video, uh, but basically what I'm going to do is I am going to sit in front of the camera before I watch a film, tell you which film I'm going to watch, what I've heard about it, what I know about it. Um, then I'm going to watch the film, come back and give you a tiny little recap of what I thought about the film. Don't know whether it will work or not, but just thought I'd give it a go. So, for the first episode, um, or the first video in the series, I'm going to be watching The Art of Getting By. Um, I don't know much about this film. I bought this when I first started collecting, um, which is about two years ago now, um, because another YouTube channel... I can't remember who it was, um, sorry if it was you, um, had this um, in one of the halls, said it was a good film um, and it was a great coming of age film and that's all I know about it. I know that it's a coming of age film, um, I know it's about an hour and a half long um, and yeah I'm just gonna give it a go, give it a watch um, and see what I think of it. Uh, so I will catch you after I've watched it. So this movie's rather good. Um, I'm still sort of digesting it and I still don't know whether it's a decent and alright movie or whether it's an amazing movie. Um, it basically um, follows the story of uh, this guy called George. Um, who is in his last year of high school, I believe, in America. He's just about to go to college. Uh, all I know is he's about 18, uh, because in the UK we have different systems of education. Um, and he's um, a bit depressed, and he's quite... Um, sort of he's, he's quite disillusioned with life, I suppose, and he, he doesn't really think that life's worth living, or... Well, not really worth living, he's just, he just doesn't think there's any point to life, I suppose. Um, and he doesn't do any of his homework and that sort of thing. A typical sort of troubled teen story. Um, and he is also an artist, so he likes doodling and that sort of thing. Um, and he's a really good artist. He meets this girl um, who essentially... it's. You see that that's the trouble I'm having with it that's making me be a bit iffy on it because I don't know whether it's just too sort of stereotypical I suppose and too sort of like run of the mill. Um, he meets this girl, uh, falls in love, she turns his life around essentially um, and yeah it it's quite good. It's 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 a good coming of age story. I would recommend it if you can get it for reasonably cheap. Um, I'd definitely watch it. Um, yeah, it's 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 a good film. It's a good coming of age film. Um, and some parts it's not a really emotional film, but some parts of it are like oh, and tug at heartstrings a little bit. Um, but yeah, it's a good film. Um, See, that's the trouble with me recording these literally the second after I finish watching it. It's because I, I don't really have a chance to digest it. Um, I may make a, a recap of some of the films that I do before and afters for just sort of saying my opinions after I've had a chance to digest them. Um, but yeah, this is a good film. Um, I've got to say that there is... It's rather... The, the, it's, it's rather inspiring. Um... There was a point in it where I was like, oh my, if he can do this, then so can I. If he can, I'm not going to spoil it, but near the end it was like, if, if you can do this, and if you can get, I know it's just a film, but it's like, if you can get, I don't really want to spoil it, uh, but if you can get something done in in such an amazing way, then why can't I, why can't I? apply the same things to my own life um re really incredible it's yeah 
I'm I'm leaning on um I'm sort of uh, veering away from the um it was just an average film and I'm starting to think it was a great film. Um yeah. Really good. The art of getting by. I definitely definitely give it a go and give it a watch. Uh, especially if you can find it for cheap um or if it's on one of your st I I'm not a member of Netflix or not love film because I like collecting physical uh, media but if it's on that and you're a member of it then definitely watch it it's worth it if you can find it for a reasonable price then go for it the art of getting by I would recommend it so that is the first before and after tell me what you thought of it and tell me what you want me to watch and do a before and after on next time